Use case number three. Whenever a case is created and case origin is phone, set the priority as high or else set it as low. Okay. So now there is an additional check. Whenever the case is created, so what is the object in concern? It is the case object. We'll be writing the trigger on the case object. What is the event type? It is the insertion event. So whenever the case is created, so we'll be writing it on the insert context. And alongside that, you have an additional check. You need to check based on the case origin. You want to set the priority. Okay. So let's go to the case trigger. I'll create a new new trigger. I don't have a case trigger yet. So let's create a case trigger, and this would be on the case object, right? Let's go to C and let's open case. Let's say submit. What is my event? It should be before insert. So whenever a case is created based on the case origin, I want to set the priority. So let's do this. First of all, I need to check the event if the trigger is before and the trigger is insert. I want to do certain things. And what is it that I want to do? I want to iterate over my trigger dot new variable which has case records. And I want to check if the case record in question, the origin is equal to phone. That's when I want to set the case records priority to high. And if that's not the ca case, I'll just say case record dot priority equals low. All right. So this is how I can check the if condition and I can check the case origin. I think origin is not a field. I think case origin would be a field. Let's save it now. Right. It says case origin is not a field. Maybe it's origin. Let's save. Yeah, so it's origin. Okay. Now let's go back. Let's go to cases. And let's create a new case. Okay. I'll create a new one. I'll attach a contact, I'll attach an account and case origin, I'll set it as phone. Okay. Now the priority should automatically be set as high. Okay. I'll not choose anything here on the priority and I'll just say save. So as soon as it is saved, let's take a look at the priority. See, it is set to high. All right. Now if I go ahead and change the case origin to email, will it change to low? What do you think? Let's click on the save button. Let's see what happens. See, it is still high. Ideally, it should be low. Why did it not change? Because we are only tackling the insert scenario, not the update scenario. Okay. So this code chunk will work only for the before insert context, not for before update because we have not written it down. Right. So that was our third use case.